Hello and welcome. I am Zinder and this is episode 5 of my Minecraft Let's Play. Now, as you'll notice, I'm in a slightly different spot than where I was before. And that's because of two reasons. One, I started walking forwards and realized that my fraps didn't feel like recording. It was being bugged out and I ended up needing to reinstall it. But uh, you didn't miss anything because when I logged in, I turned around and looked and that zombie was not there anymore. Which was kind of boring. I actually wanted to log in and be, you know, being pursued, but uh, it wasn't happening. Now, in case you forgot, which I doubt you have, but when I last stopped on episode 4, I had just been killed by my spider spawner. Which is actually kind of funny that I was killed by my trap that was designed to kill spiders. At least we know that it can kill me, but it wasn't from the drowning that killed me, it was the spiders that were landing on my head from the trap. But we do know that they were going down there, and the skeleton is about to not like me. And I have nothing at the moment, and I was also going the wrong way. Um, we're gonna get back down here, and all my stuff should hopefully be sitting at the end of the, uh, the collection area. And I went through the wrong door. And apparently I left this door open last time, which is not good. I didn't want to do that, and I shouldn't have done that. But, we're going to down here and see my st stuff. Okay. Oh, great. I was worried about that. Apparently, at least with the block over my head, I can't collect items whenever they're sitting right here next to this slab here. But I'm going to break this with my hand. Now this should be... Yeah, it looks like I got all of my stuff back. What I'm going to do is I'm going to chop out this one block, put a cobblestone slab back in, and I'm going to see if I can still collect them. I may potentially have to jump in the water, and if that's the case, well, I'm not going to do that. I'm instead just going to move this whole thing back. Now, I don't know if you can hear the spiders dying in the background, because they're not. Um, I don't know if that's just because I haven't been here long enough for them to be drowning, or if something's wrong with the trap and it's not working. But there is definitely spiders inside of there. And, oh, they apparently saw me and are currently fighting the current, so... I'm going to have to come up with some kind of a solution to that problem. Um, my first solution, I'm going to be trying to, I'm just going to block it off, like so. I think I might have heard a spider die, but I don't think so. I'm going to move away to make them stop trying to chase me. And my plans for this episode is I'm going to go deeper into this cave system. Of course, unarmored, as usual. You know, I'm just going to come back to this later, if it's not working, but I'm going to go deeper into this cave system. You know, how many times am I going to repeat that? This time, first, I'm going to go drop everything off, then I'm going to do what I just said, just so I don't repeat it again, and I'm going to go looking for redstone. Why redstone, you might ask? Well, I'm real big on using redstone, and therefore I want to go find some. I'm going to take one... Well, I'm going to take basically most of my normal things with me that I take. Um, however, I don't have as much wood as I would like. And I'm just going to hope that I find something. Preferably redstone. I'll probably just end up finding more iron. And hopefully this episode won't take longer than I intended like the other ones did. And I've also just noticed that I now have enough wool to uh, make enough for a bed. So I'm now going to be, I'm going to make a bed, and it, it was night time when I came here, so I'm just going to sleep in the bed, not long enough to pass the night. That wouldn't be very interesting. Oh, wait, apparently my leave bed option is missing. You cannot leave the bed in single player anymore. I don't know how long it's been like that, and I know you still can in multiplayer, but I'm just going to now find that one area that went really far down, and I'm just going to go ex explore. 
and I should have brought more torches with me, but I didn't. Oh, wait, I have a stack of 64 but sitting in my inventory, and block this off. There's a, oh, creeper. Oh, creeper. I'm going to use up some more of the stone sword. I don't even care. Okay, I managed to not take any damage from that, so that's nice. Um, oh, here we go. Farther down in, some more iron. Lots of darkness. And a dead end. Used up all my torches on that, though. And I do go overboard on them, even if I don't have too many left. Just because I don't want to be walking back through with a bunch of stuff and get killed by, say, a creeper. I've died enough to creepers so far. And I can, it's probably going to happen some more. Gold. This is good. I will make some powered rails out of this sometime in the future. As soon as I find some more of them. I haven't been keeping track of the time. And I know it's nowhere near enough. But I'm uh, just going to give a forewarning. It's probably going to be another longer than I intended episode. But at least I'm not really trapped with some kind of specific limit anymore. Um, YouTube did at one point. But it doesn't really seem like they do anymore once you've verified your account using mobile phone. And this is not the right way. I should have known. I followed the torches. I've already been here. Especially when the creeper blew up right here. Um, I was planning on making signs and stuff to, so that way I wouldn't repeatedly run back in circles when trying to go to the spider spawner. But... I don't have much wood, and I don't feel like going out inside and gathering it right now, even though I accidentally made it morning. I didn't want it to be daytime. I actually was trying to avoid making it daytime just to keep things more interesting, but the leave bed button wasn't there anymore, and I actually don't know if it's never been there, because usually in single player when I try and sleep, I'm doing it to pass the day and not so much just because I want to set my spawn. There's a patch of lava there, and there's a little bit further down. Um, I'm not going to be cheap and use F3 to bring up the debug thing to see how deep I am, but I do know I saw some gold, so I'm getting a little bit deeper. Just going to make a huge roundabout here, probably reach a dead end. Oh, that was a good guess. I don't know if you could see that. I do turn up the brightness a little bit in my recorded videos, but I could not see the end of that when I... Uh, was saying that. That wasn't just me making a prediction based off of what I saw. And these are some random patches of lava, but I don't want to get... Oh, I didn't want to get rid of the lava. I wanted to keep it for later purposes, but I apparently screwed that up. So, but I do have that big patch of lava right there on the surface. So, it's not like I'm not going to have lava. There was a zombie through the wall. I heard him. But, we're not going to get there just yet. Now, as I was trying to do with the other one, I'm just going to try and save this lava for later purposes. Hopefully not walk into it on the way back. Partly because I don't want to lose all this, well, it's not a whole lot, but I don't want to lose the gold I picked up. Oh, skeleton. Detour. Oh, another skeleton. Oh, that's a lot of skeletons. And that one's wearing some kind of crazy pharaoh hat. Oh, don't kill me, don't kill me. Whew. I really should put this food bag on my bar. It's not a whole lot, but... I've ended up way down inside of a cave before with... Oh, are you kidding me? Another spawner? You've got to be kidding me. Whoa. Whoa, chest. Didn't mean to click the chest. Now, I see there's zombies and skeletons in here, and I don't know which one the spawner is. Oh, it's zombies. Well, I do know that I'm going to be at no lack of zombie meat by the time I get in here. Oh, jeez. There we go. That should decrease the spawn rate by a good bit. Now, I am just going to block this off. I should grab the mossy cobble just so I have it. And... Wow! 
Wow, that is a lot of buckets. Buckets, buckets, and more buckets. I'm just rolling in buckets. I'm really glad that I didn't make any buckets beforehand now, as bad things would have happened, such as waste of iron. Because I do have plans for the iron as well, other than just tools. But, uh, I'm not going to disclose anything right now. Apparently I was trying to axe that block. I was actually looking at the destruction graphic and not my tool, so... I wasn't even sure why it wasn't breaking at first, but... I was guessing because it looked like stone, just out of the corner of my eye. Um, I'm rambling about nothing. Okay, I'm going to gather this mall scene. I'm going to keep going down this cave. If I die down here, it'll be very, very bad. But should I need food, zombies are easy enough to kill, and I'll just come back, kill some more zombies, get some more food. It's, it's... Wow. Just... What? What? Okay, there is apparently... Oh, that's, that's not where I wanted that. There is apparently... Mossy Cobble over here. And I swear to God, if that's another spawner, I'm going to be very confused. Oh, that is definitely another spawner. Oh, and it's skeletons, and they're currently fighting each other. That's right. Play amongst yourselves. Leave me alone. Oh. I'm not entirely sure how I'm going to get down in here safely. Just just keep shooting each other. Ow, 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 ow. Iron sword, go. Oh, this is bad. Oh, no. The good news is, is I'm nearby. The bad news is I don't know the exact path I took down there. But, I do know I never came back through here. Um, I can't believe that, though. That is so many spawners in such a short area. And it's, it's three different ones, even. Um, but I'm going to... have no idea where I'm going. I'm going to assume that... Oh, no, I don't want to be there. Oh, I know what I did. I came down here, and because I came down through there, I came back through here... Went down through here following these torches. Some of these were already here. And then I made my way up. And... Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Oh, oh, here we go. This looks like the right direction. Okay, there's where I went past that lava. There's some... Torches to nowhere land. This is a very confusing cave system. Now, here's where the zombie spawner was. Continue past here, and it should be... Yep, right there is the skeleton spawner. I'm gonna get in here and... Do something. Oh, God. Gather all my stuff up. Try not to die in the process. Oh, that's bad. Okay, well, that is the worst solution to this problem, but... I don't really have many options. And... I damaged a random pick. And... okay. Oh! Oh, you... You were just not the nicest of people. I I really, really can't believe that there's a spider spawner already. Now, I could trap that to... Uh, oh, there's some redstone. That's just what I wanted. Oh, creeper! Well, I'm definitely not tra trapping it now, but I didn't want to trap it because it just makes arrows easy and... Well, arrows isn't really a fun way to approach things, usually. It's it's simple, it's easy, and 
I don't have a skeleton spawner anymore, but I do have the largest supply of mossy cobble I've probably ever had in a short amount of time. I don't know how many I'm at, but I'm getting plenty out of these spawners. Oh, there goes a pick, and apparently I just threw that one on the ground. I don't know, I, I've never seen so many spawners spawn so quickly, and it's actually at the point where I need to, uh, I plan on giving the seed out in the future, like, should I ever do so much that I decide that it's time for a new map, or, you know what, I'll probably just give the seed out at some point so people can play through. I'm not going to be, you know branch mining my way through stuff, so I'm not really too worried about people giving me locations of diamonds, not that I would pay attention to them much anyhow. I have no plans to use F3, so I will never know if I'm anywhere near any of the locations that somebody tries to tell me. So, I am going to light this back up for one. Um, I'm going to grab these chests, saves me wood because I don't have to make some then. Some mossy cobble hiding back here, where I apparently forgot to keep digging. And there's a phone going off in the background. And, wow. Well, now you guys get to hear how my phone sounds. And no, it's not a cell phone, I'm too cheap for one of those. Um, but I do want to get down here, and this water actually seems like a really good way to do that, but I want to move it up to right there. Now I'm just going to ride this waterfall down. Oh, apparently right to obsidian and redstone. I don't really have to worry about anything falling in lava, mostly due to the fact that the water reacts faster than the items will fall into it. However, this water is going to get annoying equally quick. But this appears to be all that's down here, other than some more iron. As much as I want iron, I'm not going to make the effort to do that, mostly because mining while in water is not fun, and I really want to avoid it. But um, I didn't check to see... If this is even actually recording, which is terrible of me, it should be. I was having issues where it wasn't saving the recordings afterwards before. Maybe they were just too short, I don't know. Um, but, yeah. I don't know. I haven't really been keeping track of how long I've been recording. This was some pretty good exploration, though. Came down, got what I was looking for, which was redstone. And it, it might end up being a short episode... I'll probably look, and I'm not just going to stop it, I'll probably do something, try and give you an idea of some of what I plan to do. I don't know if I have enough redstone for what I want to do yet, so might as well just keep going. It's a lot easier to just stop in the middle of a cave than it is to say that I'm stopping and be completely wrong. Um... Now, I'm pretty sure I could probably could have just dug through the wall down there and found redstone fast enough, but I don't want to do that if I can so help it. If I hear an extravagant number of mobs on the other side of a wall or something, I am going to dig through, mostly just to shut them up and light up the area where they're at. But looks like I'm running out of torches, and I am in dire need of wood. And this is apparently a very large cave. Um, so, I might actually just make one of the first things I do, that of making a tree farm, which, it, it, it's probably not going to really be that much of a farm, I'm probably just going to use my collected bones, which I have some back at the, uh, the, I don't, I don't even know what to call it, my shanty, back at my, uh, dirt, cobblestone, just random shanty, random block shanty. I got some bones back there, and I'll probably just bone meal stuff in the future, but in the meantime, there was a lot of pine trees around where I was that I can just strip apart. 
but I have no more torches on me, and I know I could make some. I didn't want to, but that little dark area up there is going to get on my nerves. I need to get rid of it. That and there's water up there, which I also want to get rid of. Give water. Now, I could just fill them in, but I've got all these empty buckets on me, and there's no reason not to fill them with water. So, why not? Why not? Instead of giving a block, why not just take something away from them? And there's a huge room here that, well, I'm never going to find my way out of here. Oh, creeper! Creeper! No, go away, creeper! Don't you dare blow up my torch. Oh! Well, I didn't want him to blow up my torch, but I suppose watching him explode on a skeleton was completely worth it. No, 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 no. That is a lot of gravel. There is a lot. Oh. That was probably just me. I thought I heard something walking on dirt, and I was like, oh, I must be near the surface. But... I was walking on dirt. And I have no idea where the end of this water is. I think I saw some light, but I think that was just from where I came through before. I'm wondering if there's maybe another exit to this cave. Wow. Thinking maybe I will just spiral my way up to the surface. And then mark it so I can come back down in here and continue where I left off with ease. Although, I don't know if this is really a helpful decision either, because if I come out a lot further away... Oh, that's not good. Actually, there's dirt up there, so I'm going to dig this way. Oh, no. More sand. I do know that... Crap. That's what I was afraid of. Underwater. And it's nighttime. I have no idea where I am. Oh. Oh, wow. I'm nowhere near as far from my house as I thought I was. Let me see if I got some iron on one of those chests. Looks like I did. I don't have to kill any of these sheep since they can just eat some ground now. Ground. Eat some grass to replenish their fur. I don't really need saddles. I never plan to ride a pig. But I'm sure I'll find some more in the, uh, the future as well. Sure, another zombie. Still can't believe that I had found three monster spawners. And there is now two creepers trying to eat me. And there is a lot of sheep over here. And apparently... Just so many creepers. Just so many creepers. Pressing the wrong button. Creeper, no! That creeper looks angry. Angry Creeper! Ow. Well, apparently my dirt is full. Um. So many sheep! I'm just not gonna worry about them now. I'm gonna need to make a farm. Which, I need to get wheat going before I can even do that. I don't know how things are, how far those things will stray away, but whoa! Looks like a ravine. Wow! I'm surprised I never even saw that before. Guess I didn't go over that far, and when you're walking past it, you don't notice anything strange just due to where it's located. Actually, what? Okay, I, I I thought that lava pit that I saw was near my house, but that is a completely different lava pit. 
sun's coming up, that would make that east. And I see no indicators of my position at all. So I'm just going to check how long I've been recording. And then I will be back with you. Well, actually, I'm just going to call this an episode here, and I will just start up the next one from here. So, this is the end of episode 5, and the end of episode 6 will also be uploaded shortly after this. So, I will see you, well, in the next episode. So, yeah.